Hi guys, my name is Ozzy. Today I'm going to be doing a review on the You Matter Breast Cancer Awareness Edition hoodie from uh, Demetrius Herman. And let's get it. So I gotta play smart. I've been getting dope cheese every time my phone rings. It's your so this is the hoodie right here. It says You Matter in this nice bold pink. And it comes with this, uh, it comes with two cards actually. One is a card on how to check for uh, signs of breast cancer. And then I'll just, I'll just show you guys right here. Let it focus. You guys go ahead and pause this and read it. And I'm just going to go ahead and read it out loud too. It says, in the shower with the pads slash flaps of your three middle fingers, check the entire breast and armpit area you're pressing down with light, medium, and firm pressure. Check both breasts each month, feeling for any lump, thickening, hard knot, or any other breast changes. Two, in front of a mirror, visually inspect your breasts with your arms at your sides. Next, raise your arms overhead. Look for any changes in the contour, any swelling or dimpling of the skin, or changes in the nipples. Next, rest your palms on your hips and press firmly to flex your chest muscles. Left and right breasts will not exactly match, few women's breasts do. Look for any dimpling, puckering, or changes, particularly on one side. And number three, lying down. When lying down, the breast tissue spreads out evenly along the chest wall. Place a pillow under your right shoulder and your right arm behind your head. And using your left hand, move the pads of your fingers around your right breast gently, covering the entire breast area and armpit. Use light, medium, and firm pressure. Squeeze the nipple, check for discharge and lumps. Repeat these steps for your left breast. Or well, you know, you can also go to the doctor too. They I think like there's a certain there's a certain uh, what's the word I'm reminded to cut this part out. Anywho, and then the next card it says, "Thank you for your order. This item was made especially for you and your size and color that you selected. Due to the pre-order nature of this program, we are unable to provide exchanges and refunds. All orders are final sale. If your product is defective." We have received something different than you ordered. Please reach out to our customer service team within five days of receiving your package at hello at shopdemetriusharmon.com. If you order multiple items, you may receive multiple deliveries. Please be patient. Your remaining items will ship soon. So I ordered this hoodie on October 4th, and I got the hoodie on October 30th. So it took about three weeks to get here. So that's that's 26 days. Yeah, 26 days. Cause it was a pre-order, and then they shipped it out like a few days before the 30th. So like I want to say it was like the 27th or so. And then on the back of the card it says, With your purchases, a portion of the proceeds will be donated to Nanny Angel Network, an organization that offers free child care relief to mothers diagnosed with cancer, and the Pink List, an organization aimed with the mission to serve as a center for breast cancer education and resources. I'll provide an aid to students affected by breast cancer. Thank you, Demetrius Harmon. So, let's go ahead and show you guys that real quick. You guys can go ahead and pause it if you read it. If you didn't hear my voice clear enough, I'm going to go ahead and flip to the other side. And I bought a red You Matter hoodie like two years ago. I actually never posted a review video. I don't know why I didn't. I, I guess I just never got the time to edit the video. But uh, that hoodie, I got it for like, it was, I got it for $50 and then shipping was like 10 And then this hoodie was 65 And I bought two of them. So it was free shipping. Well, actually, no, it wasn't free shipping. The shipping was still $10. So it was, it was like 100 like 100, what is that, 65 plus 65? It was like 100 40, no, no, I'm right now, I'm kind of tired. My math is bad. So 60 plus 60, that's 120 Five. That's 130 plus 10 dollars shipping. That's like 140. Yeah, I feel like I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and check my emails because I, I think I got the receipt in there. I'm pretty sure. Okay, we're fourth. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So each hoodie was 65. So the total was 130, and the shipping was 14.99. So I paid a total of $144.99. All right, cool. I see my mouth, guys. It's a Saturday night, and my brain is just tired. I've been in school all week. I can't, 
my capacity to do like math after a certain amount of hours is just completely done. But anywho, I really like the message that uh, Demetrius Harmon is doing with the Umatic hoodies. And uh, I remember when he first made these hoodies a few years ago, it was like to help people with, uh, with thoughts of suicide, who had suicidal thoughts or suicidal tendencies. And I'll have people like, oh, well, a hoodie can't help, you can't help you prevent suicide. And that's true, but it's more so just like a reminder for people who like, you know, need some motivation to keep, keep hanging in there. Because a lot of times, people with suicide, they kind of feel like no one actually cares about their existence. And even though they feel that way, there's always somebody that will notice you when you're gone. Like, I remember I was reading this one article about how, like, this one person, they used to smile all the time when they got on the bus. And there was another person that always took the bus and saw that person. And them seeing that person made them feel, like, pretty good for them when on their way to work. And one day they stopped seeing that person and then they found out that person committed suicide. So someone's always going to notice you, even if you don't notice them. That's why it's always good to leave a good impression on people. And when you meet people or encounter anyone, even if it's just for like a few seconds or a minute, treat them with respect, treat them with kindness, and don't be a jerk, you know? You never know what people are going through. Like, I don't usually talk about this, but my own cousin, he committed suicide earlier in uh, January. And... It kind of hurts because I didn't talk to him as much as I could have, and I always gonna feel some type of guilt. Like you know, I, you know, I, I didn't push him to do the things that he did, but I'm always still gonna feel somewhat responsible for his his passing. So, you know, while you have your friends and family, go ahead, talk to them, reach out to them, and yeah, mental health is like a topic that a lot of people shy away from, especially in the black community. People tend to feel like, oh, if you have Suicidal thoughts. You're weak. You don't. You don't really uh, know how to handle your emotions. But people with suicidal thoughts is usually not that simple. Like even as a person in the military, I've encountered a lot of people that have suicidal thoughts because they can't handle being far away from home. Personal things that come up. But just so many factors that uh, go in with suicidal tendencies. It could be something as simple as an eating disorder, something as a breakup, or just things going on in their family, in their household, like divorce, splitting of the household. Just, there's so many factors, but uh, just remember to check in on your friends and don't just be, don't just talk to your friends when you need something. Actually check in on them and see how they're doing. It's not always, hey, can you do this for me? But hey, how are you doing today? Like, let me talk to you. And sometimes it's not even like you having the conversation is just gonna magically make them not want to commit suicide. But it's just the concept of you checking in on them and actually hearing out what they have to say and making them feel like you care, because you should care, that's your, that's your friend. Or at least, you know, if that's your friend, you should generally care about their well-being. You don't want to see your friend, like, gradually destroying himself and not even notice. And I know with our own personal lives, we get busy, we got school, work, focus on our own goals, so sometimes we tend to not notice what other people are going through or we ignore them. Whether it be on purpose or by accident, we should uh, try to make time to look out after our friends. And so, basically, on ones on the wrist, it says, I feel weak, but I know I'm strong. So right here, it says, I feel weak. Let me wait for it to focus real quick. Oh, I got it. There you go. I feel weak. Is it upside down? No, it's not upside down. And then on the other wrist it says, oops, twist that real quick. I know that I'm strong. So I feel weak, but I know that I'm strong. And then on, is it on the right arm? It says, it says, your life matters. And it has the breast cancer awareness ribbon as the L. So it says YLM, your life matters. It's pretty cool. I like this detail. The right uh, You Matter hoodie that I have, it doesn't have this on it because it's not a breast cancer awareness hoodie. It just says You Matter and then it has the I feel weak, but I know I'm strong on the wrist. You know, a common thing that happens is that people with suicide tendencies, uh, especially the people that tend to self harm, as a form of getting attention or just testing out the waters of them trying to take their own life, they slit their wrists or cut parts of their body. So that's one of the reasons why it's on there, for those of you that don't know. And the quality of this hoodie is really good. It's a really thick hoodie. 
it's not a Hanes hoodie. It's not a Gildan hoodie. I don't know what uh, what brand of hoodie it is. I'm guessing it's just like from a, a special manufacturer because it's not that, that cheap quality. Because you know how like a lot of like people that make their own merchandise still use like Gildan or what's the other one? Or Hanes or just some cheap alternative and then it'll print something on there and then it'll be like it'll be overpriced like a hundred dollars and but it'll be like fifteen dollar quality but this hoodie's actually thick it's warm and it's perfect for winter and another thing I like about it on the tag it says you matter by Demetrius Harmon and then the size that you get it's uh, highlighted in the color of the hoodie that you have so um, is it pink? no no it's actually highlighting the color red I'm slightly colorblind so I got a size large and the size is highlighted in red, which is pretty cool. I like this. And these it's just a small little details. And then it's got the black drawstrings, then the little silver eyelets for the drawstrings. There's nothing on the back. All the details are on the on the arm, the chest. And the wrist. So yeah, that's pretty much it for this review. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how the hoodie looks like on me in the next part of the video, and I'm gonna just highlight uh, all the small details as well. So uh, stay tuned, and I'm out. Peace. Definitely. When it come to my way, I can't tell you my secrets Wanna do it my way, then just study my language I want for y'all to understand where I came from grieving And I've been watching everything I witnessed the seasons Respect my name, respect my face, what I attain I was born for this, but more than working, I don't play Respect the struggle and my pain, respect the change I became better, but I mean I'm still the same Interpret my words correctly and understand You can elevate, but who you are will never change Still you at the end of the day And that's gon' follow you way beyond the grave Tell me where were you at when I was fighting them demons The luck on me at our time in the streets I was beeping Police locked me up for carrying and concealing And I was in the cell fulfilling these belly beating Having dreams that I was free, I ain't realize I was sleeping Living nightmares when I woke up, facing time I was tweaking I know people talk down on me instead of praying for my spirit But no weapon formed against me, finna prosper on Jesus Get the Bible on me daily, I ain't know I was reading Call yourselves believers, but be acting like heathens I thank God for dark and nights, you see who's shining and gleaming I never lost my light, I kept shining and reaching when it come to my way, I can't tell you my secrets Wanna do it my way, then just study my language I want for y'all to understand where I came from grieving And I've been watching everything I witnessed the seasons Respect my name, respect my face, what I attain I was born for this, but more than working, I don't play Respect the struggle and my pain, respect the change I became better, but I mean I'm still the same Interpret my words correctly and understand You can elevate